This is one of a series of videos designed to provide both information and support to our clients. This video will show how to correctly undertake a straight edge survey, which is a measure of flatness on composite concrete slabs when using steel decking, also known as surface regularity. Surface regularity is a deviation in flatness under a straight edge. It is not possible to construct a suspended concrete slab on metal decking to a tight surface flatness or defined datum. As default, SR3 classification is normally applicable. Occasionally, it may be possible to achieve an SR2 classification. An SR1, however, is not possible with composite concrete on steel decking. When attending any site, appropriate protective equipment, or PPE, must be worn at all times. A dimensioned survey location drawing, along with a steel decking layout, is also required. You will also need a suitably sized measuring tape, a 2 metre long straight edge, a metric graduated wedge, and a means of recording the survey measurements. It's also essential that the area be free from standing water, debris or other obstructions before undertaking the survey. Using your dimension survey location drawing and measuring tape, locate and set out the first survey point. You should refer to a steel decking layout drawing to establish span direction in the location. For composite concrete slabs using steel decking, the straight edge must always be positioned perpendicular to the decking span. A common error is for the straight edge to be placed with one end situated on a high point and the other supported by packers to achieve a suitable level. Another error is that the edge of the straight edge overhangs the greatest identified gap unsupported. To avoid any doubt or confusion, the correct procedure must be for a 2 metre straight edge to be placed in direct contact with the concrete slab surface resting under its own weight. The deviation must be measured between two points which are in contact with the floor surface. To measure the extent of the gap, insert the metric graduated wedge into the identified gap at 90 degrees to the straight edge until the wedge is in direct contact with both the underside of the straight edge and the top of the concrete surface. Take the measurement from the point of contact between the wedge and the straight edge. Ensure you accurately record the measurement. Repeat these steps until all location points have been surveyed and the measurements have been recorded. Once completed, you can successfully review if there are any areas that are out of tolerance and may require remedial action. It is recommended that this type of survey is carried out within 30 days of installation. We hope you have found this video of interest and that it has helped you carry out your survey. For further information, please refer to publications produced by the Concrete Society, the Metal Cladding and Roofing Manufacturers Association slash Steel Construction Institute, the British Standards Institution, and the Construct Concrete Structures Group. For more information and other tutorials, please visit our website and YouTube channel using the links below. Thanks for watching.